It's good to see you on Pastor Kim, and uh, I'm delighted that we're here to worship together today, and uh, kind of a special day because we're baptizing a couple folks at the end of our service, and it's a special day because in the midst of the very troubled world that we live in, I guess I could always say that, but it always feels like it's getting more troubled, but um, in the midst of all of that, we're choosing to worship Jesus Christ, to speak well of Him, to speak well of God, to look to the Bible for our answers, and to worship Him as our King and our Lord. But I want to tell you something, when you obey the Lord, when you obey the Word of God on this level by keeping this tradition, this, this ritual, uh, all of heaven stops to watch what we're doing. Uh, angels and demons alike all watch to see what this thing is that we are reenacting life and death and resurrection and statements of faith and we're doing it out in the public and it's big and it counts for something big that you may not see but it's a big deal so when people chose to be baptized and baptized in the name of jesus they were being baptized identifying with his death and identifying with his resurrection coming out for new life and so letting the old life be washed away and the new life in christ to come forth it's a public declaration of faith. Hi everyone, thank you for witnessing this momentous occasion. Ah, oh, God is so good. He's so good and to love him is a journey in and of itself. To follow him, which, is the, which are the steps I'm taking now, is life changing. And it's only been really couple months since he's called me in such a powerful way that I couldn't resist it anymore because he's always been there but I didn't always listen <laughs> which is a part of being a willful human um, but I've now surrendered my will to him, surrendered my ways for his and it's been the best decision I've ever made. It's been challenging a lot of the old ways are dying hard, but there's new life, and today is just making it official. <laughs> um, and I am now a new creation in Him, and I am choosing to live for Him because it's a choice. Um, even if you are, you know, raised in it like these little ones are, or you've come to it later in life, it's a choice. And when you make a choice, it's a commitment to whatever comes. And right now, I'm just really grateful for this community and all of you witnessing this moment and just supporting me in my walk with Christ. And yeah, I love you, Jesus. Thank you, all this Not quite there. 